Well, hello everyone. This is Kimberly here. Welcome to Diva Designing on a Dime with Kimberly Davis. Today I will be sharing with you how I organized under my kitchen sink. So we're just gonna jump right in. All right guys, you see what I am working with up under my sink? Very difficult task because all of this is in the center <laughs> of my cabinet underneath my kitchen sink. Uh, I have a very difficult task to try to organize up under my kitchen sink because um, all of the unit here is in the center. It's not to the side, so I have to work around everything. So guys, first off, I am going to take up the liner. Um, I did this when we moved in about two years ago and it has ripped. Um, I was not concerned about around all of the garbage disposal and the piping. Wasn't concerned about that. I just did a square. I'm gonna do the same, but I am going to use my favorite liner. And it's this by Duck the deco liner here adhesive um, I picked this up from Walmart and you've seen this if you've been watching me because I've lined all of my uh, cabinets and um, the drawers and inside the cabinets with this this has a damask print so let me get this um, down underneath the kitchen sink and we'll go from there All right guys, so here it is. I pretty much did it the same way um, I did it with my previous liner. I just did it like a little box in there to make it easier on me. I'm not concerned about cutting out around the piping. Just want it that down. Now the fun part begins by organizing up under my kitchen sink. First off, I'm going to start off with this double slider unit here that I picked up from Target. It's in like a champagne finish. I um, thought this was really neat. Um, I had to be precise and measure because uh, with this being tricky, not all units will fit up under the space. So when you're organizing, you're under your kitchen sink, measure first, all right? <laughs> And I also picked up this cabinet basket here. Um, I caught this one clearanced. Uh, it's the mate to the double slider there. So looking forward to this as well. Both of these came from Target. What I love about this double slider here, um, the basket has these liners here and they fit in here perfectly. So if anything should happen to spill, uh, the metal part at the bottom is well protected. All right guys, and here is the inside of my cabinet underneath my kitchen sink. Um, what I really had to do is really take a look at the products that I use because I love cleaning products I love trying different cleaning products but I had to make a decision to purge and use only the items that I really need all right so we're gonna go in and take a closer look at what I'm storing up under my kitchen sink. On the door there I have my um, hanger that I picked up from Target here. This caddy here and it holds my Mrs. Myers products that I use every day. My multi-purpose cleaner there. Uh, my dish soap. 
and this is a bottle here and I will label it um, that's my bleach I put a, a couple of squirts of bleach in my dish detergent every time I wash dishes and this is my little diva brush here isn't she cute <laughs> You see that silver caddy there right there I picked that up thrifting paid a dollar for it then I went to Target to get these containers here and those containers there hold my tablets my sponges and my wool pads in the back there's three containers there and then I have this one container there up top there that's in that Dollar Tree container that's holding another brush there that I picked up from the Grove Collaborative. Now next to my containers there I just have an extra dish soap, Mrs. Myers, and two bottles of the Fabuloso. I can't put anything else back there due to the garbage disposal. Alright. Okay, and to the left of that, or in front of the garbage disposal, I have my liquid gold wood care polish there. And behind that is some Resolve carpet cleaner there. But before I move over anymore, um, I have that liner, that damaged print liner that I love, that I have pretty much on every shelf and uh, bottom of my cabinets. Um, I think I pretty much have it done. I may have a few pieces that uh, cabinets that do not have that damaged print. Starting on the left side here you can see what I use and I have just what I need. Um, no more. I have my Lysol all-purpose cleaner as well as my disinfectant wipes by Lysol. I have my leather cleaner here for my sectional in my family room. I have my oven cleaner. I have my baking soda back there and I started to put that in a container but changed my mind. And I have my borax back there. Now this caddy here was also picked up from Target here. Um, down below I have my mop um, towels down there as well as some extra gloves, cleaning gloves back there. And then up top here I have uh, my glass top, my glass cooktop cleaner. as well as some wipes back there have that whole brand by Weeman and then I have some dishwasher cleaner fluid back there as well as the rinse aid for my dishwasher and on the left door here I have my gloves hanging here on a command hook and a clip. So guys, this is the inside of my uh, cabinets underneath my kitchen sink. I hope this has inspired you to take a look at some of your cleaning products and do a little organizing uh, of your kitchen sink. This was done inexpensively, guys. It cost me too much. Uh, just the organizer there and the one on the door. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and share. And if you have not done so, I would love for you to become a part of the Diva family by simply pushing that subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. And when you subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell so you will be notified of all the videos that I upload. 
I can be followed on other social media sites, which are Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, as well as Twitter. The links to those social media sites, they will be listed in the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. You take care, you be blessed, and I will see you on the next video. Love you guys.